Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss about how to uh, reset the Red Hat Linux 9 password of the root root user password how you can reset without using any external DVD or anything else. You just have the physical access of the Linux machine. If you, you will have the physical access of the Linux machine, you can uh, reset the password or change the password. So uh, this is the actually video listed from the uh, Linux security, uh, how you can protect uh, when anybody going to be access your system physically and can change your password. So how you can protect them. Uh, this, uh, the things I will cover in my course, the Linux security. And uh, uh, you can get the boot camp or the course pre-recorded videos, some free materials, course content, question answers from my app. So the app is given in a description box. The link is given. You can download and you can use it. Okay, so now I am going to show you how you can do this. First, I am going to reset the machine. So once I hit uh, the machine is resetting, there is a two options are exist. One is a, uh, a rescue, enterprises rescue mode. Another is a uh, there is a two kernels. So on the first, I am going to select this one then press the E, uh, E in your keyboard, press the E. So I have protected already this. So no problem. I am going to uh, give the enter here. I have protected already. Okay. So no problem. If uh, the protection is not exist, username and password is not exist. So you will reach on this uh, screen directly. So how you can protect, I will show you later on. But right now I am going to show you how you can uh, track this one. Okay. So simply when you do that, you need to uh, write here the rd.break only. That's nothing else. You just press the control X for rebooting the system. Once the system will reboot, uh, you will be able to access the uh, you know switch root you will access the single user mode interface in this interface you can just simply type the passwd and change the password no you cannot so what you need to do you need to remount the same uh, root uh, system root so how you can do that by using the mount option and hyphen o for the option uh, option is a remount and the permission is a read write and what I want to do it, uh, sysroot here, sysroot. So I have mounted this one. So first when I will mount it this, then I need to get the ownership of this. So I will use the chroot uh, and sysroot. Uh, um, again, change the ownership. So you can see the shell has been access of the root. Now I am in and I will change the password here uh, easily by using the passwd command here, uh, change the password. I am using very easy password. That is the reason it is showing it is the bad password, but uh, no problem. Uh, all authentication token has been updated successfully. It means uh, now it's fine. I have updated my password. I have changed the password. Now, if I will reboot the system, will it work? No. Because the previous password uh, restored, so I need to do the auto readable here. So first I will create a blank file. So it, it, it will try to find out the relabel like SC Linux is there, security is there. So it will use the auto relabel. So I am creating this auto relabel. Once I will create this, then I will again mount the same thing. Uh, mount by using the hyphen o option is remount but this time i will do it a read only because it was the previous one read only to the slash okay so once i will do that then i am going to be done the uh, yes everything is good now i am going to exit in exit so it will reboot the system and once the system will reboot uh, you will get your new password and you will able to access the root. And once you will access the root, 
here every thing in your hand so guys uh, i am sharing such type of the videos and uh, interesting videos as well as some tips tricks and uh, so follow my youtube channel and uh, subscribe my channel if you want to be learn lots of the things our web free webinar free boot camp so you will download my app and install it thanks for watching see you in the next video